I would really appreciate if you would take a moment and subscribe my channel below and like this video. So today in this video, I'll be sharing with you guys some decoration ideas that you could use to decorate a room or a place whichever you want on someone's birthday. So without any further ado, let's begin the video. Take the colored paper which you are using. Here I am using a black colored paper and I have divided the paper into 6 equal halves. You can also divide the paper into your desired number of halves you like. Now I am marking the midpoint of one part of it and drawing an angle of 45 degree with the protector. Make a triangle with the marked measurements and then fold the paper as suggested. Cut the paper further. Keep these papers aside. We we'll use them further in this video. Here are the six pieces which we made now, and I've already made some more seven. So now let's paint on them. I've written the letter with a pencil on it, and I'm doing a white colored base for the letter as the color would directly not be visible on a black paper. <music> Gather all the letters together and make them with the same alignment so that the punch goes equally to each and every paper. Do the same with the rest of the letters. Now you will need some strings or ribbons to tie all the letters together. So here I am using a golden ribbon. There are many ways to tie the ribbon with the letter. Here I have suggested three ways in which you could tie the ribbon and I am using the third way because it covers the paper a little bit and looks good. Now I am going to tape the ribbon from behind so that it stays firmly and the letters do not move. Take your sheet of cardboard and draw the desired letter, then cut the letter and paint it with the color of the kite paper you have chosen. I have painted it pink and now fold the kite paper as shown. Draw a circle on the folded kite paper and then cut it out. Do not throw the extra kite paper, we will use them in further DIY. Now draw a spiral shape in the circle and then cut it out. The process for making this spiral into a flower is by rolling the outside into the inside and then sticking it by glue. After the flower is made, slightly cut the bottom part of it and then stick the flower to the letter. Do this to call the flowers until the letter is completely covered with flowers. <laughs> First of all, take a big cardboard box and put a small cardboard box in it. It is not necessary to use the big cardboard box. You can directly go for a small cardboard box instead. And now I am filling the small cardboard box with some stones and then 
I'm spreading it all evenly and putting my card on it. I'm decorating the borders of it with blue flowers. It is not necessary to use the same flowers. You can use flowers which are available at your home. Put the box into the big box and then add some thermocol balls to it. You can also add the extra kite paper from the second DIY. Now I am adding the letter which I had made in the second DIY on the box and adding some fairy lights around it. Instead of the box you could also put cake on it. For this DIY you will need the extra paper which I had kept aside in the first DIY. Now write a message or quote on it and then roll it using any sharp objects here I am using a quiller into a thin roll like so now you do not need to stick it take a balloon and keep the rolled paper inside the balloon keep it properly so that it doesn't fold and then blow the balloon this will be kind of a decor also and then the birthday boy or girl should pop the balloon to get the message. For the next decor you will not need any DIY materials we used like in the previous DIYs you just need to light up the room or the place you want with the available lights at your place. Hope you all enjoyed watching the video. Like this video if you found it helpful. Also comment down which one was your favorite DIY. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share this video. Meet you in the next video. Till then stay safe, stay home and stay healthy. If you haven't watched these videos yet, what are you waiting for? Go watch it now.